The Charleston River Dogs baseball team plans to host the youth baseball teams that were impacted by this shooting. The children will have access to Joe Riley Park, the Joe, next Tuesday afternoon. News News Riley Benson heard from officials following this announcement. Players on the field during Monday night shooting will have an opportunity to get back to baseball in a big way here at Joe Riley Park. Officials hope it'll serve as a way for those players to heal and move forward. On Monday, players and parents were sent running for cover as gunfire rang out during a youth baseball game. Now the Charleston River Dogs are hoping to make a difference for the kids after some parents say they're too scared to take their kids back to Pepper Hill Park in North Charleston. The River Dogs, Major League Baseball, and Fayetteville Woodpeckers are teaming up to host the remaining innings of the game at Joe Riley Park before holding a picnic and inviting players and parents to stay for the River Dogs game. They'll hope it'll help keep a love for the game alive. So baseball, you know, it's a game, but it's also an escape from the reality, and that's what we want to do when we open our gates is provide an escape from the things going on in the real world, and, you know, hopefully that we can do that for these kids when they're out here this uh, next week. Not everybody gets to make it to this level, and so for kids to come on this field, that's probably, I don't know, eight or ten times the size of what they play on. Um, it's a unique experience for them, and, you know, for some, it's probably the only time they may ever get to step on a professional field. The players and their families, the Lingus, to hang out and watch the River Dogs game right after that. For now, reporting in downtown Charleston, Riley Benson, count on two.